Hello. So today we have a simple and not deadly command creation. Since it will be about the time display for the players. This command creation works in single or multiplayer. With this command, you can see the exact time of the day in Minecraft. I have set it to a military time format. But I'm also planning to make a normal time format for this. This command creation might be helpful if you are planning to make a werewolf or vampire abilities. If you prefer to those abilities to be only activated during night time. But the main purpose of this creation is to display the exact time for the players. So anyways, without further ado, let's get moving. So before we proceed to the commands, let me prove it to you that this time command is very accurate. First, at 12 o'clock noon, you will see that the sun is directly above me. So if you are wondering how do I get the exact time in Minecraft, the answer to that is very simple. Well actually, not that simple, since at first I tried to convert the real time to Minecraft ticks on my own. But, I just ended up stressing and wasting my time. Since while I'm researching about that, I found that Minecraft Wiki already have the conversion that I need. At first, I thought this creation will be scrapped, luckily I found that. So anyways, you can see here that one day in Minecraft is equivalent to 20 minutes in real life. And with this another conversion, you can see that one second in real life is equivalent to 70 to seconds in Minecraft, or 1 minute and 12 seconds. So if you check the time display on my screen, you will see that it adds up 1 minute and 12 seconds every second. Oh, I forgot to mention earlier, this is the second, this is minute, and this is hour. So yeah, let me show you some more evidences to prove that this time is accurate. Based on Minecraft Wiki, the moon will be at its peak at exactly 0 o'clock. That seems peak for me, so that's another concrete evidence. Here's one more, based on Minecraft Wiki, players and villagers awaken and rise from their beds at 6 a.m. in the morning. So let's see if this villager will wake up or he'll be a lazy villager for the day. You see that, at exactly 6 o'clock the villager woke up, ready to earn money for the day. Now if a player tried to skip the night, I put a command to correct the time for that. As soon as the player woke up, the time will be set to 6 o'clock. So yeah, that would be all for the demonstrations, time to move to the real deal. So first, we need to create the scoreboard objectives that we will need. Now for the minute. And lastly, for our. Now after that, place an armor stand somewhere near the command blocks. It doesn't need to be exactly right here. And make sure to name the armor stand to clock. Now here's the commands. This command will display the text for the players. I know it's kinda long and might be confusing. So I put the commands in the video description. You can just copy paste the commands there. Now for the second command. Make sure to add 20 delay ticks here. This command will simply add 12 seconds to the clock armor stand every second. Now for the third command. This command will add one minute to the clock armor stand every second. Now for the fourth command. So with this, when the second of the clock armor stand has reached 60 score, this command will add one minute to the clock armor stand. Now the fifth command. So when the second of the clock has reached 60 score, this command will set the second score of the clock to zero. Next, for the sixth command. 
So when the minute of the clock has reached 60 score, this command will set at 1 hour to the clock. Now for the seventh command. So when the minute of the clock has reached 60 score, this command will set the minute back to zero. Now here's the eighth command. So when the hour of the clock has reached 20 for score, this command will set the hour back to zero. So these commands will complete the time display on player's screen. Now let's prepare the commands in case the player skip the night. So this is the command that will detect if a player decided to sleep. And speaking of sleep detection, if you want to learn more about movement detections, I would recommend that you check out my video for that. I'll leave the link in the video description. Now after the ninth command, make sure to place a comparator that will detect the output of the ninth command block. Then a redstone torch where it can be deactivated by the comparator. Now for the tenth command. So this command will simply set the second for all entities to zero, since it doesn't really matter if any entities besides the clock armor stand has a zero second, minute, or score. That's why there's really no need to add a filter here. Now for the eleventh command. This will set the minute for all entities to zero. And now for the twelfth and last command. So this will just set the hour score of all entities to 6. So yeah, that would be all commands we need to make this thing fully functional. Oh by the way, after doing all of the commands, you need to sleep to make sure that the time will be accurate. Perfect, now the time is accurate. So yeah, that will conclude all things about this accurate time command creation. If you think you like this creation, then don't forget to like the video as well. And of course, subscribe if you haven't yet. So before I end this video, special mention for my highest channel members. I really appreciate them since they don't just watch, they comment also. So you, what are you waiting for? Comment something as well. Anyways, bye.